Hello, 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 everybody, and welcome back to a, to, to, to a long time. It's been a long time. We are back, but I'm not going to continue the other series. It's for one particular reason, which is it's been a long time since I've played them, um, and... I find it difficult to maybe jump back in, whereas if we start anew, we can have fresh, we can have fun. So, we're going to be playing Mechanical Mastery, which is a mod pack I've seen played, and it looks great fun. So let's call this home, as I always do. Let's seed it as Ollie. I don't think it matters, because it, it, oh, Ollie, uh, because Ollie, it's a sky block anyway. Um, and yeah, let's create world. So I'm very excited to play this pack. I've, uh, I've tested it a little bit, I quite like it, it seems like good fun, so let's see what sort of madness we can jump into. It's a, it's a, lot, of, a lot of automation, and it's something that sometimes I'm very bad at. <laughs> oh yeah, I'm in my new room. <laughs> Completely new background, still a mess of stuff, but we're here now, uh, and I wanted to start recording so that we can actually get back into the YouTube vibe. So, let's wait for this to load. We are here in our sky block. Let's just do the first thing and just chuck those books away. So we've got some quests. Welcome. Mechano Master is an expert is an expert yet not horribly grindy sky block mod pack and we're an expert. Uh, focused around automating everything in order to keep progressing, EMC has completely been overhauled and ra only raw resources such as chunks have EMC. A new mechanical essence can be crafted out of these raw materials, each multiple, uh, material, with multiple tiers, each uh, giving exponentially more EMC. <laughs> the more complicated they get, in order to succeed in this pack, you need to learn how to automate these things. Mechanical essence automate these mechanical essences and gain as much EMC as possible. Good luck. Welcome. So, uh, configuration panel. Oh, I see, yeah. So I've seen this, so you can either, like, banish the moon, uh, banish mobs and stuff. We'll leave that for now. Um, what we'll do is we'll jump into this. Welcome. Yes, there we go. So we get transmutation table, bread, white bread, Coal, lava, water, water, and sapling. Lovely. So that gives us a bunch of stuff that we actually don't want to touch straight away. Um, and it wants us to get wood. So there's, I think, altar mines in this, but it's usually bound to grave, isn't it? Yes. Let's quickly rebind that to... I like to bind it to uh, key grave. There we go. Ultimine. Oh. Ultimine. There we go. Button four, it's bound to. Button five? Fine. I can live with button five. Uh, and there we go. Now we can at least just break this tree all in one without having to faff. Ooh, a chest. Oh, yeah, I know, I know this is here. I've played this game. I'm, I'm not pretending like I haven't. I just genuinely forgot. How deep is this island? Uh, I think it's deep enough that we can maybe go down a block. Oh, oh my god. Ugh. Ugh. I tested this on my laptop, so I haven't actually adjusted, like, some of the... Oh, damn it. I think dirt does have EMC, though, so it's not the biggest worry to lose a piece. Um, I just want to go down a block so that we're nice and level. Lovely, and now that some grass has spread, we can break the rest of this. Lovely, and let's just let's just fill in this a little bit, so that we can have a nice little square platform. Let's move you. Perfect. Let's put you over here, and then let's plant another tree. And ba bam. Gimme. Lovely. And what we probably should do now that we've expanded the platform a little bit is we should put at least one of these down next to the chest. And we can learn coal, we can learn saplings, dirt, and oak logs. And now we can take a sapling out. 
we can put all of this in here for now and we can continue to farm some trees and then realistically we can just move straight to cobble um, because cobble has EMC it's quite a quick process because we can do this we can get a pick what quest have we completed? Oh, get some saplings and this will get us some clay. Uh, cool. So let's make sure, first thing you always want to do is just chuck those in there because otherwise if you end up doing, uh, if you don't chuck them in there and you lose it, uh, it's gone forever. So bad. Uh, we technically need this here, this here, and this here for the cobble gen to work. Because I like to do the cobble gen like a so, where you have water runs down, lava comes across, there we go. And we technically only need one of these boys. Done. Because now we can learn you uh, there we go. And we can have a stack. Perfect. Stack of... Oh, that gave us a stack as well. Oh, uh, put that away. Uh, and now we can learn all of these things. So, redstone. Iron. Copper. Gold. Al aluminium. Or aluminium. Uh, silver. Lead. Nickel and tin. Yeah, okay. And then we want to just immediately, as I said previously, chuck this all in. Because if you don't learn it and you drop it off the edge, you are done for. So that is all in there now. And technically we can pack this away actually because it's more of a hazard than anything. Um, and we have infinite cobble to our disposal now. So let's grab all of that. Let's grab a little bit of dirt. Maybe like six. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six. Perfect. And let's get rid of this little expansion we did over here because we don't need it anymore. And we can now expand ourselves out a little bit. This is the quickest probably like stack of cobble people ever get in a skyblock is uh, thanks to EMC being in this mod and it just being like, hey, get one, and then done. Uh, so let's just expand out two blocks. I don't want to expand out a huge amount right now because I want to make it look kind of nice. But I always like to um, like memorialize the starting, like where you start sort of thing. I know I've taken us down a level, but it doesn't really change the fact that this was spawn. Um, so it's nice to, it's nice to keep looking pretty. Uh, eventually we will come back here and sit in awe of what a what a world we've developed around this area. So, now that we've done that, let's mine this away real quick. And let's have a look at what it wants us to do. So, basically wants us to progress into um, automating these is where we're, we're looking for, basically. So that needs us to have iron gear, aluminum gear, copper rods. Okay? Um, that's basically what we're heading towards. Oh, any rod. Oh, a stick counts as a rod. Fair enough. Um, so, first things first, obviously, we'll want a furnace at least. So let's make a furnace. And we're going to try and be very um, careful, because we have 32,000 EMC, but that is all we have. Um, so, the more careful we can be, before generating EMC, the better. So let's just do this, and then we will... Well, this technically counts to cook something, right? So let's just cook up eight iron to start with. I think there's nothing wrong with that. Uh, let's break you. We're going to get one, that's fine. Put you in there. Uh, ooh, no, I don't really want to waste... Well, actually, it's pretty much doing the same thing. We can probably get one more iron, um, but that's fine. Cool. 
while that's going on, I will replant a tree and we'll let that grow manually. So, beginning thermal autom automation. It wants us to do a sterling dynamo, so let's bookmark that. Also wants us to make a engineer's hammer, let's bookmark that. And then any plate, probably an iron plate, but we'll have a look in a second. Uh, what plate did this need? No plates. Got it. Good to know. Um, so realistically, we want to go from here. Mm, Constantin blend? No, we want this one. Also useful to know. Um, servo press we don't really care about right now. A redstone furnace, probably pulverizer. That's what we want. Um, that's the that's the big ticket. So, what do we need for the pulverizer? We need eight copper. Got it. One gold. Got it. Ooh, ooh. Um, one. So we're going to need at least one redstone, which is going to need us to use at least three iron to make an iron pick. Okay. Let's try and be very careful with this, so we're not wasting. Um, so redstone, we need at least you. Okay, so then with that and a little bit of cobble, I don't mind taking a stack of cobble, it's not not end of the world, we can make a piston. Right, piston done. Uh, then we've also got these bits, so that's fine. So we need a gold, and then I think eight uh, of the, oh that's bauxite, eight copper because once we can start pulverizing we will be more efficient part of me doesn't even want to waste the coal part of me says let's just break this and make some charcoal but let's try and be a bit more reasonable with this shall we and we'll do this as charcoal furnace at the bottom so uh, let's Try and come on, give me these other ones. We need them. Need them for the charcoal expansion. The coal age is now. Right, love it. So that's made one. That's fine. We chuck that in there. Chuck that in there. Perfecto. Right. So that's going to make us some coal. So then we want these two. What else did we need? Um, four tin and we need four iron. So we've got the four iron, so we just need four tin. Uh, and then we need the stuff for the sterling dynamo, which needs iron, iron, uh, redstone, and another gold. So we need another gold. We probably need another eight iron. Um, and then that's any stone. Does it need to be can cobblestone or does it smooth stone? I think it's smooth, right? Yeah, smooth. Okay. Um, do we have enough redstone? I think we have enough redstone. So let's start smelting some of this down then. Let's put this here. We could technically make another furnace. I don't think that's wasteful to make multiple furnaces. Um, and then at least we can try and be a bit more efficient with this. So that's eight there. We need another one to cook this eight. And then we need one more furnace, maybe, so that we're not interrupting any progress, to then do these four, and then these two. And we need to watch that one. Uh, this one, we can do that. That's fine. OK. This feels good. This feels good. So once we've got the sterling dynamo, we can start to pulverize things and then cook the dust. And that will double our output, obviously which is very good when we have dwindling EMC and none coming in. The only EMC we can get, obviously, is from wood, and that's like 32 a piece, and obviously when you're looking at something that's 2,000, that's quite a lot of harvesting. I don't know why I keep looking over there. That's because I'm looking at my second monitor where my face is. I should be looking here. That's a lot of EMC. <laughs> there we go. Um, so we're going to need to do this, which allows us to make a tin gear right then we need 
I think actually we can make that now. Yeah, okay. So then all we're looking for is copper gears and the redstone flux coil, which, sorry, is the coil to redstone? Yeah, we need more redstone. So let's do this. Let's just quickly yoit, uh, that off the edge. Maybe a, a decent amount. Seven might do. Um, let's just chuck that back in there for now. We've got that, we've got that, and we've got that. Okay. So we need this to do that two copper gears and then we need two of you and then we do this then we need oh stone yeah we need smooth stone don't we um, let's take that out let's get eight and then what did it want us to do uh, sorry what are we missing uh, iron gear got it one of you, clear that, and then I think we're just missing the two smooth stone, which we've already got one of, let's wait for the last one, and two, perfect. So now we can make the sterling dynamo, and we can complete a couple quests, okay, now we're talking. So then let's come over here, and put uh, you down here with you, ooh, well that was dumb wasn't it, with you, there we go, okay, now we can put you in here, you will generate power, which will give to the pulverizer, got it, cool, 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 let's chuck you in there, we need more wood, so we definitely could use the coal obviously, but the coal ore is quite expensive, um, and considering I can just do this real quick and generate, what, 43 more coal? I, I think it's the better way right now because I'd rather be able to buy, well, buy, use the EMC for resources such as, like, iron than anything else. Um, so now we've got pulverizer sorted. That's good. What quest have we completed? Oh, yeah, okay, that's fine. This is the multiplying all of your ores basically until you get to I think like 3 3.33 x multiplied ores um, we're just doing like very basic multiplying with the pulverizer for now pulverizer sometimes uh, uh, some items can serve as a catalyst for pulverizer oh how do we get flint then We'd need gravel, which I guess is pulverized stone. Right? Okay, that's fine. Um, because I think the catalysts are quite useful when doing, like, I don't know. Yeah, optional catalyst. It doesn't give you what how much they produce, but I, I presume it's good. Um, so let's let that grind through. Uh, we'll grab that and put that there for now, just so that can keep cooking. Um, right, so now we can pulverize things we could do with um, powered cooking, maybe. Um, well, look, let's let's do this, which is the engineer's hammer, which I think we've got the stuff to do. Yeah, cool. And then it wanted us to do. Uh, any plate. I haven't seen anything that needs a plate and I don't want to waste making a plate without needing to, if that makes sense. One of these uses a plate, I'm sure of it. Oh, maybe not. Uh, oh, this uses in-bar plates, okay. Yeah, we're just gonna... Well, we don't have any resources, so we could make some invar, I guess. Um, how do you make a invar plate? Invar, I believe, uh, will want the blend, which is two iron to one nickel. Got it. Oop. Uh, so two iron, one nickel, which we will then pulverize. Uh, can we pulverize this straight for flint? To give them like a hundred percent chance, 
Because I don't mind wasting a little bit of coal on doing this. Sand. Nope. Not what we want. Not what we want. Uh, let's pulverize that for now. Let's just break some of this. Can we craft it? Actually, wait. Uh, recipe uses. Uh, no, you can't. Okay. Sometimes there's that crafting recipe where it's like three gravel is like one flint. Which is like horribly inefficient, but when you can't be asked to do this, it does feel much better. Because <laughs> this is just dumb. Right, well that's our two iron done. Let's get our nickel done. Give us a flint. There we go. Just trying to ding quests, for God's sake. Allow me this. Oh, so we got a copper dust out of that as well. So then we should be able to do this, which makes our invar blend, which I think was another quest anyway. It is, and that gives us four uh, invar. Let's put these in here with the blend. They'll cook up nicely. Uh, we can then, I think, do this. Oh. Turns out, can't even make a... <sighs> That's very annoying. Okay, um, in which case, let's cook up one iron. And we're just going to crush that. Or actually, let's cook up this one copper we got. Save the iron. Because we got that as part of um, pulverizing, which is at least nice. Um... And we're just going to bang this into a plate, because I don't care. I'm cool like that. Plate done. So that's this now technically finished. Uh, is how you will get your first plates and rods, yeah. Um, yeah, because that's only mildly cheaper to use as a multi-servo press. Um, right. Got it. Um, I believe what we really want to aim for is a mag mator. We want to aim for, I think, this. Um, it's quite expensive, but then we can run a mag magma generator off of this. And these are much better than coal. Um, and all we would need for this is. No. Well, these are good. It's one of these two. Um, we need a um, magma crucible. We need one of these as well. This is basically, this is dream goal right now, these three things. Um, which is invar, we could do nether brick, nether rack. Oh, I think that comes from chapter two. Yeah, okay. So, it's a little bit far off, but that's the that's the dream right now. Uh, let's get rid of it then for now. It's, it's too far away. Um, I'm too 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 ahead of myself. Um, but I think that's where we're going to call it today. So I think we've made good progress on this first tree. Next episode, we'll try and crack out the rest of these machines and try and make our first basic mechanical essence. So thank you very much for watching, and I will see you guys in the next one.